uh, the GGR is growing in Italy. Uh, I think not only because uh, the players are, are growing, but uh, thanks to the action of recovering of the legal market that was done. And uh, we have to thank uh, my predecessor that is here today for this, uh, for this action that was really effective. And uh, we have uh, regulated uh, almost uh, all the type of games. And uh, we are working for the introduction of the bingo variant that uh, we still miss. And uh, I have to add that uh, had everybody could ask or could be interested, uh, we are dealing with a new tender for 120 licensees. And uh, we finished uh, our job as ADM, and uh, we are waiting for uh, the tender coming back uh, for the Council of State. Uh, so I hope that um, the new tender could be useful uh, also to recover another portion of uh, illegal market. Uh, yeah, uh, as I said, uh, I hope that the new tender will be a good occasion to recover the market. Also, because uh, the number of players uh, is pretty stable, so I think that recover the legal or the not authorized market, because we have here regulators that have different point of view on this, uh, on this different, uh, it's useful also to um, have a, a healthy market. And uh, apart from the, the new tender, as uh, I think everybody know, we use the inhibition of illegal website. We have already uh, um, blocked uh, 6,000 uh, websites. It's easy for the website to have a redirection, etc. But I think that is uh, important for a, a cultural point of view because with a block from ADM, the player knows that uh, uh, he was uh, um, playing on a, a I think, uh, okay, it works. And uh, a point that I think it's really important uh, in the fight against the legal is also the cooperation between uh, regulators. And uh, this going on uh, informally and uh, thanks also to the expert group, uh, because I think that sharing information between us is really important. But uh, uh, this is uh, important also the supplier's part, the supplier's side. And in this sense, uh, ADM, as I said before, make uh, agreements, uh, informal agreements with the supplier to have them serve only the legal and authorized. But uh, if uh, in this sense uh, we can uh, discuss uh, uh, in the difference between the legal or authorized, uh, what is important for me is also to underline the important action that the police force uh, and judges uh, are doing in Italy against the real illegal market uh, and the dangerous one. We are really important action that uh, are uh, going on and I hope that this uh, will clean the market. To con it's difficult to, to say something new after to be the last one, <laughs> but uh, about B2B, we don't regulate them, and uh, decide to regulate them would be a general de decision. So in, in this seat, uh, I can speak only from my point of view. And from my point of view, have a framework of them could be useful for them and for us. For them, to avoid the uh, incredibly hard uh, administrative burden and to have uh, easier controls. And uh, for us uh, to control them and to know who they are and to contact them in a easier way. Uh, about the international liquidity, everybody knows that there's a French law and so that uh, we are uh, cooperating and we are working hard to reach uh, our result, uh, as Charles says, uh, possibly fast. And uh, I think that uh, it's a, a really interesting issue because uh, it could be an experiment also for us to cooperate better and stricter between the regulator 
and it could be interesting also to have a model to apply to other game uh, if it will work. So we are studied, we are saying the juridical and technical aspect and uh, in my opinion it's uh, really an interesting challenge for us. And uh, to conclude on uh, advertising, we already have a really severe legislation and the uh, last financial law prescribed that we have to keep in mind the recommendation principles that is uh, already almost uh, implemented at all. Uh, I think that the restriction is already severe and uh, I, I think that uh, a total ban could only uh, help the legal market because uh, if you have a total ban, the player can't uh, tell the legal from the legal one, uh, as Christian said. So in my opinion, it's already severe and uh, it's, it's enough. <laughs> do, do you see any push of uh, getting this even uh, tougher, even more uh, limitative? Uh, uh, I know that there's some idea in this sense, but not a push. So, I, as I said, uh, we, we just have the ban on the journalist program from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., so I think it's just, uh, uh, it's just severe.